Um, obviously, we knew that he was in St Thomas's Hospital. It was all over the news, and that he had then gone into ICU. Um, but our daughter's very professional, so we don't um, ask things or, or she doesn't spill things. So it really wasn't until he was out of intensive care that she actually told us. Well, she said she had just had a most surreal time in her life, something she will never forget, and that she had been taking care of Boris. Well, it makes us feel exceptionally proud, obviously. Um, but she has told us these things over the years and it doesn't matter what patient she's looking after. This is what she does and I just find it incredible that she, any nurses can do this for 12 hours, sit and watch a patient and twiddle away with all the different knobs and things they do to keep their patients alive. It's absolutely amazing. I think over the years she has always told us that her job is one-on-one -on -one nursing with very critically ill people and that means she's there all the time for the 12 hours so once we had heard that Boris Johnson had gone into intensive care it was obvious that at some stage uh, Jenny would possibly run into him and be giving him the same level of care that she would have given anybody else the week before or next week and we're really proud of her.